Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, hi, my name is Chrissy and today's build was a highly requested one. So I am really excited about doing this build with you guys since we will be doing an expansion to look like a mansion. And don't worry, it's not going to cost you another Nook loan. So for this build, we will be needing plenty of space. Specifically in the front, you will be needing a 5x5 space on either side, as well as a 3x3 three three space on the sides of your house, uh, since we will be doing some terraforming. If you guys don't have this much space, well, I guess you're going to have to move your house like I did. So next will be the essential items that you will need to getting this look. Uh, you'll need the following two loft beds, two antique clocks, two wedding organs, eight simple panels, two kids tents, and a partridge in a pear tree. LOL, JK, I actually don't know what that means. Uh, but all the rest of the items that I'm going to be using are completely optional. It just depends on how you guys want to decorate. Also, remember that the simple panels have to match or get them as close to matching to the outside of your house as possible. Alright guys, the moment you've all been waiting for, let's get started. Sorry guys, I forgot to mention that these simple panels on your house have to match the outside colors you picked, uh, but not only that, the roof colors also have to match the furniture behind it, which is why I picked the brown kids tent as well as the brown furniture. It makes it look more cohesive and blends a lot better.
So this part isn't super essential, but I definitely wanted to add some waterfalls to the outside of the house. Not only for the picture value, but because it adds a lot of depth to your house. Uh, I also noticed that the cliff sloped a little bare, so I decided to put some standees to cover them up. Uh, if you guys need the codes, I will be posting them in the description down below. Alright guys, we're just adding the final touch to our house, and with that we are all done building our dream mansion. And let me tell you guys, it feels so good walking out of your house in the mornings to see this. I hope you guys enjoyed this build as much as I love making it for you. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. As always, I will be posting the codes and items that I used in the description below. Thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you guys next week. Bye!